Welcome back everybody. Today we're gonna go over three things that you probably did not know about your Mr. Buddy heater. Three secrets that turns your Mr. Buddy into more things. Taking your emergency heater to emergency cooking and more. So whether you're wanting to learn about unlocking these secrets about the Mr. Buddy you already own, or you wanna just learn about another indoor safe option for emergency heat, stay tuned because these are some pretty cool tricks. Welcome back to all of our wonderful subscribers. Thank you for watching. If you're brand new here, you like emergency tips, prepping tips, news that affects you, be sure to hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss a video. Let's jump into this one. So like I said, maybe you guys already have a Mr. Buddy heater and you wanna unlock these secrets that you didn't know about your Mr. Buddy heater. And if you don't even know about this indoor safe heating option, I found it still on sale at Costco for a great deal. And I'll leave some links to some different Mr. Buddies down in the description below. So let's get going on these three things that you can do with your Mr. Buddy heater. Okay, for starters, and this is not one of the three tips, but this bag is pretty ideal. You can put your propane hose in here, tank on this side, tank on this Got side. A nice shoulder strap, but you can grab and go. This has been more handy than I thought it would be. Because I like just knowing that I can grab this thing, it has everything I need, and I can go. Did you know that you could cook on this thing? Okay, so for starters, what you're gonna do is you're gonna pop off the grill. This thing just comes off just like that. Now the really cool thing about this that most people don't know is you flip it like this, turn it sideways, come back, hook it right around the handle. You have a surprisingly sturdy grill that you can put boiling water or cook something right there. Think the nice thing about these emergency heaters is they are incredibly easy to use and they're rated for indoor safe. You may have to give it a little bend to keep it flat. That way you got a pretty flat surface, but you can boil some water, cook some food in an emergency situation real easy. And this guy pops right back in down there. And then these pop right back in like that. Okay, so that's the first thing that you need to know about your standard Mr. Buddy. You can take this up another notch, having a much stronger platform. So what you're gonna wanna do is go to your local hardware store and pick up a paint tray like this. It'll be in the paint department, but this thing is crazy strong. So same idea, go into it like that, and this platform is much more sturdy. You can put a lot of weight on this thing and and it's gonna hold, it's gonna be a lot more sturdy, probably a lot more safer. But like I said, same idea, just a little bit stronger. And these things are a couple bucks. And you wouldn't believe how hot this is right here. I mean, this, this water is half frozen. But you know, in a lot of situations, you might just be cooking one of these freeze dried meals like this one, and all you need is boiled water. Knowing that you're knocking down two birds with one stone with this little emergency indoor heat, not only you'll stay warm, but you can eat and use this as a cooker. So before we get to the third secret on what you can do with this Mr. Buddy heater, that one right there is called a Buddy Flex. You can get that side cooker that goes with that, that hooks right on, that hooks right on top. But I mean, look at this, it's, it's boiling already. Not bad, huh? Not bad. So we've got boiling water off our little indoor heater. And I'm telling you guys, if you don't already have one of these little Mr. Buddy heaters, they're very useful. Whether you're going camping, whether you're going somewhere. I know a lot of people that bring these to kids' soccer games and keep themselves warm when it's really cold out. And before I forget, please share this video out so more people can learn these tricks. And let me know down in the comments below if you guys have one and if you have any additional tips. So there's one other thing that you can do with this tray. It's a really nifty trick. Now, when it comes to an emergency, a power outage, and you're trying to heat up a room, Having the heat right here is great, but being able to get the heat in the rest of the room is even better. So another thing that you can get to make this little heater that much better is a heat powered fan. And if you guys have never seen these things work, just take the fan, place it right above the heat. And 
And as it heats up, which doesn't take long at all, you are gonna have hot air circulating through the room. I mean, it doesn't get cooler than that right there. So I don't know if the video is actually picking up on how fast this thing is spinning, but instead of losing all your heat to the ceiling, now it's blowing all of that heat into a tent, into the room that you're trying to heat. But let's give you another quick reference on this, on how fast this thing heats up. I mean, that's pretty cool. Now, if you guys have never seen one of these fans, a lot of times people buy them to put on top of their fireplace, their wood stove to help circulate the heat through the room. They used to be super expensive, but I think you can pick them up for as little as 20 bucks or around 20 bucks on Amazon now. I'll try to find the one that I got here and put it down in the description below. Now, a lot of outdoorsmen know this trick, but I thought it could be super helpful to our community. And I wanted to make sure that you guys knew those tricks about the Mr. Buddy heater. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Again, be sure to share this. I've got a couple other good videos here that you might've missed. Keep prepping, keep learning, keep doing guys. We'll see you on the next one.